In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to make a basic building slash placement system in Roblox Studio. So the first thing we want to do is we want to go into our browser. We want to get this thing on the marketplace. It's called Basic Placement System by Emilki. So to do to get this, you have to click up here, get this, and you have to click Try in Studio. And from there, it's going to give you the option to open it up in the Roblox Studio. So we're going to then come into here and click on it here. It's going to say this here. Just press OK. And it's going to open it up. Now, this is what it looks like for now. And obviously, this is, this is just models for now. So what you want to do from here is you need to ungroup this. So go to ungroup here. Once we've ungrouped this, we need to ungroup all of these in specific places. So the first one needs to ungroup in workspace. So we we'll ungroup here. Next one we need to go to rep storage. So click this down and drag it into rep storage here. Then we can ungroup it there. The next one goes to server script service, which we can put in here. And ungroup there. Next one we need to open up the starter player and then drag it into the starter character scripts one so there ungroup and the final one we need to go to the starter packs one which is here and finally ungroup like that nice so this is all set up and ready to go now if you want to change anything about this you can do you can you can um you can go and edit all of these different um things that we've just created and put into different things so if you want to change the walls or you want to change the textures or how many you get or anything like that you can do that by editing all of these different things but now I'm going to show you how it works so if I hit play here it's going to load up my game oh and I've spawned in so I can run around and when I'm ready at the bottom you can see there's some different um uh uh like building blocks so I can press one and that's gonna get me the wall and what I can do from here is I can click and drag it around where I want it to go if I want it to go here and click and boom that's the wall down next I can I get a window one so if I want to put that like here I can click that down and there we go we've just put another wall there and I can then do it again here with this next one here like this um, make sure it's lined up Here, like this so that is pretty cool that's basically how you do it now obviously here it's not much use just as it is here but what you can do from here is you can go into it and you can fiddle around with the settings that you've got in here um, and just make it to your liking but that's how you do it so if you enjoyed this video and found it useful be sure to like subscribe and comment down below that it helped thank you for watching